Right, Rich, when the executives at Hickey Freeman heard the outrage over the Olympic uniform, the vice president of the company got on the phone to New York Senator Chuck Schumer. The company owned by the HMX Group promised it could not only remake the uniforms, but have them done in time for the opening ceremony two weeks from today. As of yet, we haven't gotten any phone calls saying that uh, um, uh, anyone's ready to go and have us do the manufacturing for them. As of mid-afternoon, Hickey Freeman had not yet gotten the call that its offer had been accepted. CEO Doug Williams, who spoke with us via Skype, says his company is ready to get to work producing uniforms for the opening ceremony for the U.S. Olympic team. Today we manufacture roughly 1,500 uh, suits and sport coats every single week. Um, if if uh, this opportunity were to arise, we would pretty much put down what we're doing for a, a short period of time and, and rally the troops and, and get the job done. Hickey Freeman is waiting for a call from New York Senator Chuck Schumer, who, along with a number of members of Congress, expressed outrage after the uniform was unveiled this week. I'm urging the Olympic Committee to uh, get rid of these uniforms. If they want to burn them like Harry Reid said, that's fine. If they want to give them to charity, that's fine. But they should not be used on our athletes. They should be using Hickey Freeman uniforms instead. And that would be a great shot in the arm to both Hickey and to Rochester. That is not just outrageous. It's just plain dumb. It is self-defeating. Schumer and New York Congressman Steve Israel fired off letters to the U.S. Olympic Committee. Schumer asking it to abandon the current uniform and replace it with one not only made in America, but right here in Rochester. We might have to pull a couple double shifts, but uh, the team uh, would definitely be able to get it done. And I'm sure that there is a, a uh, airplane that would fly from Rochester to London to get the uniforms there on time. William says his company has the greatest respect for Ralph Lauren and would be happy to work with him. By the way, Hickey Freeman is making the sport coats and slacks for the men on NBC's Olympic coverage team. So two weeks, pretty quick turnaround for more than 500 athletes. Actually, it is, and Hickey Freeman has to find the right fabric for these uniforms. And should I mention, the plant closed today for a three-week vacation, but Williams is confident his company can do it. We'll keep an we'll eye see. on this. Thank you so much, Lynette. Thanks, Lynette.